My name is Lewis Hipgrave. I am 21 years old and I am a Michael Jackson impersonator. I am um, adopted from Malawi in Africa. My father is a pediatrician. My mother is a social worker. For the most part, I enjoyed uh, my childhood. Uh, it was a rather privileged childhood, actually. I'd say from when I was seven to 18, I spent most of it traveling around the world and living in different places. And now I've been back in Melbourne since August 2011. I have ADHD, and that stands for Attention Deficit Hyperactive Disorder. Technically, it means that I am very energetic, hyperactive, and I have problems concentrating. There's a plus side and a, uh, and a minus side, as there is for everything. So say my mother or my father asked me to help around the house, and then they leave, there's a 75% chance that I'm gonna forget that. In regard to the park, you know, if I need a few minutes to relax, or you know, if I'm not feeling myself, or if I'm down or whatever, I you know go and play chess, and it's just a very tranquil and serene and calm place. It's like, that's like my time. It's my time, and I, I enjoy it, and I, I'm, I don't mind losing, which is which is a major plus because you know there are some people who are very sore losers and very, very bad winners. I, I mean, basically these people who I play, these elderly guys have been playing chess their whole lives and they are really, really good. So I expect to lose. For my dancing, basically, I didn't really know about Michael Jackson that much uh, until in 2008 uh, when Michael Jackson announced he was gonna do the This Is It tour. I got caught up in the hype. I decided to see if I could do some of his dance moves because I've always enjoyed being in the spotlight and eventually I came across uh, a tutorial to do the live Billie Jean uh, dance on the computer and uh, it was at this time that I realized that Michael Jackson inspires people like basically no one else. I've practiced for five hours a day, every day for like two years. And I mean, I've never actually really had a dance teacher. I taught myself. I haven't achieved very much in my life. I don't have that many actual skills. I mean, Michael Jackson is everything to me now and dancing is the one thing, is like one of the only things that I can do well. I mean, people love it and that's the, the thing is that I love it. When it comes to Michael Jackson, the thing I get most out of that is the fact that I've found something that I can channel my ADHD into. And so instead of running around being restless or whatever, I just dance. In the far distant future, what well, it's going to be like for me, I mean, it's very nice to be able to, you know, have something, you know, that I can, you know, appeal to people of all different ages. If I could do anything, I would like to be able to put on an actual concert and be able to do my moves and actually just give and share what I have with them and with anyone else who cares to, um, to experience the music and the magic of Michael Jackson. <laughs>